we've been going back a, a while, and you've had a, a, a rough couple of months. Mm. Let, let's just just put it mildly like that. Years. And I, and I, and I, yeah, well, that's true. But I find this in life. One another thing I want to clear up is that the Marvin Gaye estate did not do this. No, no, okay? they didn't. They yeah, didn't. And yeah. one thing I would like to clear up as well is the uh, Kathy Griffin Townsend and her family all came up to me afterwards. Gave me a hug and mm. said, "We believe you. Uh, none of us wanted to be here, you know. Like, I and yeah, we're good. We're good. And I feel, and I, I want to clear that up as well. There was nothing malicious in it. It just was something that I think spun out of control and just ended up, you know, no one talked to each other basically, and now we're in this situation. But I went in there with my heart in the right place, and she went in there with her heart in the right place, and you know." Truth came out, and Close. you're not retiring. You're going to continue <laughs> well, to write songs yeah. and give us love. It would have, you know, people say uh, people didn't believe me when I said that, but it really would have. You, uh, it would have taken the joy out of I writing believe songs. You. I never said I would stop stop being a musician, a performer, but I would have stopped writing songs for a while and wow. probably just sung covers or taken songs from, you know, have a, another writer write it or something. But like, yeah, I don't know. It's for me, for me, being creative is going in the studio, put my heart on my sleeve and, and releasing a song. Um, and it would have just taken the joy out of that. Yeah. Honestly, would have done. 